Okay, so let's just reiterate through LSI versus GSI so we really know the difference between these two and which one is better in each uh, specific aspect. So starting at the top here, when we're talking about key schemas, uh, local secondary indexes only have composite. Now remember, composite is both a partition and sort key. And then global secondary indexes support both simple and composite. Then for key attributes for LSI's, the partition key must be the same as the base table because remember it's local, it has to use the same partition key. For GSI's, the partition and sort key can be any attribute uh, you like. Then for size restrictions, um, the LSI has to be 10 gigabytes or less for uh, all index items. And then for GSI's, it's um, unlimited. For online index operations, the only time you can create indexes is on table creation. Uh, but for GSIs, you can add, modify, delete indexes at any time, and you can make these indexes at the time of creation as well if you want to. For queries and partitions, um, the LSIs query over a, a single partition as specified by the partition key value in the query. Uh, for GSIs, it queries over entire table or across all partitions. For reconsistency, we have strongly or eventual consistency. So you can see LSIs win over GSI in this one case, uh, where GSI is only eventual consistency. For provision throughput consumption, uh, this is shared uh, capacity with the base table. Uh, so you're more likely to get throttled here. Um, but for GSIs, it has its own capacity. So it's not going to affect the base table. And then the last one here, which we didn't talk about, but we'll talk about now is projected attributes. So when you create that table, you say what what um, attributes. So those are the columns that are allowed to be in that index. So for local secondary index, you can request attributes that are not projected in uh, into the index. Whereas GSI, uh, you can only request attributes that are projected into the index. So over those two points, you can see why GSIs are generally more recommended than LSIs. But you know, it all comes down to your use case. So you'll have to decide for yourself.